Gino here and welcome back to our channel for chapter number 39 of Jojo Phantom Blood. We are entering the final arc, Fire and Ice, Jonathan and Dio. If you don't know what this series is about, go watch all the other episodes, but basically it's me, an Italian, reading Jojo Phantom Blood with the anime soundtrack, as you can probably hear in the background. So, I don't have anything to say. Let's start reading Fire and Ice, Jonathan and Dio, part 1. Speedwagon! Yeah! Ha! Huh. I've been trying to think of a way to stop your flesh freezing technique from freezing the blood flow in my arms. And how I can send harmony to you! <laughs> the solution was just told to me by Dyer's harmony infused rose, Dio! <sighs> I'll infuse it with Hamon and cut you down with the hero, Brufor Sword of Luck and Pluck. If I channel it quickly enough through the sword, you shouldn't be able to freeze my blood. <sighs> Lower then, Frog Piece! How dare you, with your low class Hamon! How dare you! <sighs> Don't get too excited! Ah, you'll all be food for the undead! I'll rip your heads off and feed them to you! There it is! His dark personality worse than any evil in the world! His calm and collective attitude was all a mask! This is true self! It's the first time he's been humiliating by experiencing Hamon! Ah, the dead are after us! I... Straits will show you no mercy. My name is Page Jones Plant Bonam Love Solid Attack. A rose is a living thing, so it's possible to infuse it with the harmony and throw it, but. Metal isn't a living thing, so... Okay. I must do it directly. From what I've seen, Dio's speed is like a cheetah's. With Mr. Zeppelin's Hammon technique, Mr. Jostar will be able to match it. But D also has the ability to destroy flesh and bone like it is nothing. The fight will last only for an instant. One mistake will end it all! I'm going to extinguish your life! I'm going to destroy your filthy ambition! Ha! When did the idol these roses? No! Oh. Great! He got Dio's right side! His right eye is a blind spot! Oh, God damn it! He's an experienced fighter! Oh. Hey. Ah. Ah. Oh. Ah. Yes! Oh. One of my demons of the night! <sighs> and that's the end of chapter 39. Oh my god, <laughs> too much screaming! <laughs> my throat can't handle it anymore. And well, I have already said it to, like on 20 of the 39 chapters we have covered. It looked like Jonathan had the upper hand, and well, 
It is quite clever to hide things just like his grandson will do 50 years later against another vampire. I like to think that Speedwagon told Joseph of this fight actually. If you like the chapter and you want to support the medical treatment to my throat, leave a like, comment down below, subscribe and don't forget to tune in next week for the next chapter with the fight continuing between Jonathan and Dio. Bye!